Now in today's video, I'm going to be organizing my new Alex drawers and putting my makeup into them. I'm very excited and ignore this right here. We have been painting and cleaning everything at the moment, so everything's looking a bit odd. Here's what my makeup is currently stored in and it doesn't even fit. The majority of it kind of want to do a video of me like organize my makeup into these drawers but i will do a makeup collection and you guys will see it all in like it's glory in another video also my hands have a bunch of paint on them because i've been painting they're washed they're dry they just won't come off we're gonna start off with the first drawer i'm just gonna take everything out because i have been assembling the drawers while I do this, I just want to let you guys know, I do know I have a lot of makeup for one person, but I've been collecting for so long. And I also used to do makeup um, on Instagram and I used to think of some MUA. Well, I mean, that's obviously long gone now. Before anyone comments down below saying, oh my God, you have so much makeup for one person. I've been collecting for years. My primers are currently stored in this drawer right here. I'm just going to let it focus. As you can tell, it is very dusty in here. It is just disgusting. So I'm going to wipe out all my makeup, throw anything that's old, and then I'm going to organize it to this first drawer okay i'm gonna put my first drawer in here i have the she glam primer i'm gonna put it here right so i'm gonna put the revlon color stay primer in here i'm gonna put the nivea post shave balm i feel like that's just such like a known primer put the number seven one right here i'm gonna put this miss sporty primer it's actually a really good primer surprisingly i used to hate it but now i've grown to like it i have this black primer pow black primer powder powder primer Anyways, we have the black primer. We have this stick. I'm gonna just zoom you guys in a little bit so you can see a little bit better. We have this Makeup Revolution primer. I'm actually gonna move this to the back just because it takes up a lot of room. I got a Technic priming spray, another number seven one. I also have a few Benefit Professionals right here. And then I also have this Benefit That Gal primer. I'm also going to put this number seven one in here, another number seven one in here, um, a YSL primer. And then I'm also going to put in this Hourglass Mini primer. I'm going to put on my liquid primers, so I have this Pure Primark one, I have this Body Collection one right here, I'm going to move you guys a little bit. I have this Makeup Obsessions Prime and Bake, and then I also have this L'Oreal Infallible Primer right here. I'm also going to put two of my eyeshadow primers, which is the Revolution and NYX primers. I'm just going to put them on the side right, actually I'm going to put them right here I think. I also have some e.l.f. primers. I have the e.l.f. mineral infused one, the poreless one. I have this L'Oreal infallible primer right here. If I can just squeeze that in, that'd be perfect. I have a lot of e.l.f. products, but I also have this e.l.f. prep and prime stick. I actually have the e.l.f. putty, but I do have a bunch more makeup, but it's in a big box and I am gonna keep bringing it out as I kind of go along, but I'm too lazy to go through the box. I also have this priming spray, which I'm gonna put here and this mini MAC pot I'm gonna put right here. At the back over here, I'm just going to put a bunch of my setting sprays. I have NYX. I have this random brand right here. I have an e.l.f. one, I Heart Makeup Revolution, a NYX one, which is the best one. I'm not going to go through them all, but I'll just go through a few. I've got a Wet n Wild one, and then also one more, which is a Makeup Revolution one. I'm going to put my color correctors at the back as well. I also have color correcting powders and primers, which I'm just going to put in the back. The drawer does look cluttered, but I have my primers, my setting sprays, and then all of my color correctors. In the second drawer, I'm going to put all of my foundations. And here's what the majority of them are currently looking like. It's not looking the most organized. I actually hate it and um, yeah, I'm probably gonna get rid of a few as well. We got Shein. I'm actually gonna put all my foundation standing up in the third drawer just cause it's a little bit larger and a little bit deeper. Anyways, we got Makeup Revolution collection. I have Bourjois, Elf, and then the Maybelline Superstay. Two foundation sticks. I got one from Makeup Revolution and then also one from Anastasia Beverly Hills. A Wet n Wild and then also a Primer Foundation. Okay, I've put my foundations in this little section right here. I'm going to put some concealers on the other side. But I am getting rid of some foundations. Like some YSL ones. This um, foundation right here because it's just a bit too dark. <laughs> we also have a few other foundations which I'm just not bothered about. The majority of my concealers are literally in here. So I'll show you a few of them. I've got Instant Age Rewind, Primark, um, L'Oreal True Match, which is my favourite concealer, and then also the Fit Me Concealer, which is another favourite. I've got Collection Last and Perfection, which I feel like everyone has. I don't like this concealer as much as everyone else does. I've got Model Zone, and then also this Makeup Revolution one. I don't know if you can tell, but I do like Elf Camel Concealer. I do have a few more, which I will put in here. I've got this Rimmel London Concealer, I'm just going to move you guys here. And then i also got another Elf Concealer, which is actually really pretty under the eyes. I've got some Wet n Wild and a bunch of other concealers, which I'm too lazy to go through. In the back here, I'm going to put my pressed powders, but I do also have a Model Zone and Kevin Klein concealer. I got a whole load, I can't even speak. I got a whole load of these AOA Studio powders, which I'm going to put at the back. She Glam powder. I also do have these two Nip and Fab concealers, which I'm going to put right here. I hope my hands aren't distracting you guys because I know there's a lot of paint on them. Right, so you guys can see all the powders are just under there, and then my concealers and my foundations. This makes me feel like my collection is so small, I don't know why. 
This next drawer is going to be a bunch of face palettes. I got this YSL face palette, Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit, Be Perfect Sub-Zero Highlight Collection Palette. Got a bunch of mini palettes right here, which I'm just going to kind of go through really quickly. So we have some Makeup Revolution ones, an Elf, um, W7, more Elf, a Tarte, which is my favorite, a few Primark ones, this Benefit one, which I'm obsessed with. It has the Hula Bronzer Cookie Highlighter and also the Gold Rush Blush. A few Makeup Revolution palettes. we got the Soap Highlighting Kit, the Eyebrow Kit, another Highlighting Kit, a Blush and a Highlight Duo. I got the Balm Lip and Cheek Kit right here, Violet Voss Highlighter Palette, one of my favorite contour palettes, Makeup Revolution, and then also this random palette right here. Also this color correcting palette too. In this last row is just going to be a bunch of eyeshadow palettes. Got the Jaclyn Hill Morphe Palette, a Too Faced so Socklet Chocolate Palette, and then also this Mini Wet n Wild one, Makeup Revolution, Primark. Look how cute this Tarte eyeshadow and face palette is, I'm absolutely obsessed. But I'm going to put it with my face palette since I have so many eyeshadow palettes, I don't know if they're going to- Got another Morphe, a I'm bunch sorry. of Makeup Revolution. So as you can see here, I've put all my found, no, I put eyeshadow palettes in here. Now I got a bunch of different ones here and then I got a bunch at the back. Um, I'm too lazy to fully organize it, but it's all good. It's cute for now. So I've moved my foundations, concealers and powders into this drawer instead. Concealers here, foundations there, powders there. I just feel like I want to give this room to my highlighters, bronzers and blushes because I want to try and get as much as I can on this side. I'm using these organizers that I got from B&M a fair while ago. Got a bunch of blushes, which I'm gonna put over there. I'm gonna put some cover effects. Um, what's this called? I forgot the brand. Beauty Bay and Sharp Miss A highlighters here. Got a W7 and then also an e.l.f. highlighter. I got an M's Cosmetics highlighter. For my bronzers, I have Bourjois. I have an MUA one. I actually have two of these. I love these so much, but I need to remember to get myself another one. Got some MUA ones. I got a Natural Collection one. So now I'm gonna do my cream products, but I'm gonna move these all the way to the end. I got this Pink Honey... Um, bronzing frosting i always forget what it's called cream contour cream bronzing i don't remember but it's in the shade fludge fludge fudge glaze i can't speak i got a few different like things i use for cream bronzer such as a sleek concealer the illustrator thing i got a few other concealers and whatnot for my blushes i got this rimmel one and then i also have this elf jelly pop blush for highlighters, I have a bunch of different ones. I have this one for collection. I got Elf. I got number seven. Another collection one. I got a Benefit one. Profusion. I got a few different ones. I'm not going to bother going through this. I'm just going to put it down here. And that is that drawer complete. I found a few other blushes and bronzers and contour, so I'm going to put them away. I have a Fenty Beauty Cream Contour and Cream Highlight. Mama Mitchell Blush. I have a random freckle pen, so I'm literally just going to put that in here right there. Okay, I'm gonna move into the next side of drawers, but I'm gonna start from the bottom so I can start with my lip products. So here is my lip drawer. This is just my first lip drawer. I just have browns in here, reds. I got Doll Beauty, I got Bourgeois, I got Revlon, a lot of Revlon, I got some like Glistex and stuff like that here. Browns and Browns, number seven. I got here, oh my god. Number seven, I got some Fenty Beauty, um, Anastasia Beverly Hills, Maybelline, Rimmel. You guys can just. I'm gonna keep all my red lip products and I'm just gonna put them all the way at the back over here. Got my brown glasses, I'm literally just going to put them. At the front right here, I actually have lipsticks, lip glosses, and everything like that. I've had to do another one for that one as well. Oh, everything is falling out of here. But it's just because, you know what, actually? Maybe it'll just like, nah, I can't do that. Here's another lip drawer. It just has pinks and a bunch of all different colors. And here's like purple, blues, greens, and all that random shit. So that's just literally going to go all the way down there. I'm also going to put these M's Cosmetic glosses in here. And then I got a few like lip liners and shit. I think I'm going to put my lip liners in here and then I'm just going to put them to the side. And then I put my pink glosses like right here and I've changed the little tub for my lip liners. Okay, I'm back on this side and what I'm thinking of doing is I've just put all my face palettes all the way to the side and I'm going to put like my eyebrow stuff and etc. right here because I'm trying to not have all my Alex drawers just be makeup. All right, so here I have some eyeliners. I have a mixture of eyeliners and mascaras. I got a bunch of different brow products in here. And I got some more mascaras. Here's what all of it looks organized. I didn't realize, but I do have a few like other extra eyebrow stuff. Um, like these little palettes actually I'm gonna put around here. I'm also putting this pink honey brow wax here as well, because I've not used it, so I'm gonna keep it in its packaging until I use it. And also all my lashes, except for like one or two pairs, I'm gonna throw in the bin. So the pairs that I don't throw away, I'm just gonna put on top of here. We have this pair. Meggy lashes pair and then also just this random lash I literally have no clue where it's from. I feel like it's so cluttered but I just need the correct organization but I do think I am 
mean, it's not the worst thing in the world, but it's not the best. I have a whole bunch of makeup brushes and my desk is a mess. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come back in like five minutes or well, 20 minutes and I'll show you guys it all after it's organized. I have these four drawers which are spare and I'm hopefully not gonna put anything makeup related in them because I, I don't know, I just want a few extra drawers for anything but makeup because I feel like they're all just makeup. And but yeah, I'll come back in like five, 10 minutes and I'll show you guys the final result. Okay, so here's the desk. Finally, I've finished it all. I'll show you guys the drawers and everything. I've put a mirror here, a few like little gift boxes that just have some jewelry from my mom, my dad, and my aunt. And then I just have like my college lanyard and a bunch of bullshit there. I have some photos of like my mom, my dad, and my cousins, aunts, and blah, blah. I might get like a little book just to put photos of like me, my friends, and my family and like put it there or something. I don't really know. Here I have my jewelry box, which opens up here, but I never really wear jewelry. Got some jewelry in there. And then I have like my beauty blenders, brushes, and just random stuff like that here. I also have this bear and it's on its last legs, literally. So I put that there until I can probably just sew it back up. My chair currently has a dressing gown and an Udi on it, but I will take it off one day. Not right now. I'm really lazy and I also have a hammer and some screwdriver things there so drawer number one i also will be doing a massive declutter but we have my primers right here we have my color correctors and then also my setting sprays at the back there is products that i don't use in here but like i said i will be getting rid of that in the declutter video the next drawer just has a bunch of foundations concealers and powders again needs to be decluttered asap here is the next drawer which just has bronzers blush and highlighters and the cream products as well here this drawer is disgusting i hate this drawer hence why i need to declutter but it has lashes it has my face palettes eyeliners brow stuff mascaras and a whole bunch of other stuff the last drawer right here is just a bunch of eyeshadow palettes that need to be decluttered i don't wear eyeshadow ever so it's just pointless all these drawers are miscellaneous stuff i think i have like a blanket and disinfectant wipes in here and then this last drawer is a bunch of lip products and i have some chocolate in there but yeah i hope that helps i hope you like the tour but yeah, that is my desk and I hope you guys liked this video. If you would like to see my declutter, I will be posting that very, very soon. I'm also posting a makeup collection and then also going to be posting a what I got for Christmas. But if you guys would like to, you know, see more, just subscribe and like so then we can hopefully boost this video. And if you would like to support my small business, you can purchase through the link in my description because I'll put it in the description.